The feeling of being Big Ten champs is absolutely euphoric. For the first time in program history, the Michigan State Spartans are Big Ten champions. It is the best and most indescribable feeling. I can't help but smile. There's, there's no, no words for that feeling. The coolest thing about this team is they keep coming back for more. You know, Rutgers is an elite team. Michigan State, the number six team in the country for the first time ever. Today, they've got number 14, Rutgers. Oh, comes in hard on Kozer. Dropped, shot, saved by McClellan. A beautiful drop. I kind of came off with an injury kind of in the first half. Got a knot in my quad. You see that? race on DeBose's right leg. So kind of going back into the game, I was like angry, chip on my shoulder, wanted to, you know, get one in. You really had him pinned in. It felt like it was coming, but you never know if you're gonna have that breakthrough. Lauren DeBose. From the moment Lauren got it, I was like, Lauren, shoot the ball. I remember thinking, please, 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 please go in. Please go in. As soon as it kind of went off my foot, I'm like, that felt good. Lauren DeBow. Lauren DeBow. Oh Michigan State go again. To be here, to end it here with the last regular season game and to get a win, that was incredible to do it at home. Michigan State, your regular season champs and number one seed in the Big Ten tournament. I was just relieved. I was so excited for her and for everybody because we put together a pretty complete game, and that was just uh, the cherry on top. <laughs> well, this group and these girls have been through in the history of Michigan State women's soccer. To be from where we were to where we are now, it's just an incredible transition. It's like a dream come true, and it's just great to see these young women just be so successful. and and being a part of it, it feels like we're a part of it. When I look back at the progression over the last few years, I just see all of the hard work and the time that not only we have put in, but the coaching staff has put in. It's a really good move, you're working towards that. They give so much to what we're doing. Uh, they're so committed to this process. They believe in each other, they're in it together. Um, that's an incredible thing for a head coach to be able to say when you've got 32 players on a roster and they're all in it for the team. Go, let's go. This team means everything to me. I'm literally in my dream job. I'm back home. Uh, I'm coaching at the school I was never good enough to play for. And uh, it's just a special group of kids. I'm so blessed, so honored to be the head coach of this program. Yeah. To Spartan Nation, we want to prove that we have earned this. This isn't luck, this isn't a fluke, we put in the work, we focus, we're intentful with what we do, and that's the reason that we're getting results. Come on, come on. Just gratitude is the only thing I can think of. Um, this team is the absolute best. We're not done, we're not done yet. There's a lot more to prove. I think this is, just means a lot for our soccer program, especially our women's soccer program. I think this is a great starting point. And you know, with all the records we break, there's more to be broken with the, you know, the girls that come in in the future. To set it up like this is really important for the legacy. I, I think now we're, you know, being taken seriously and I think we're a soccer school now. <laughs>